Torker Robot Reducer consists of three parts. Wave Generator, Circular Spline, Flex Spine. Wave Generator with an elliptical geometric feature. It makes the Flex Spline engaging with the Circular Spline, usually used as a deceleration input. Flex Spline, thin and elastic metal with external teeth on the outside sphere. Continuous elastic deformation during operation, usually used as a deceleration output. Circular spline, the rigid circular part with teeth on the inner bore side. And there are two teeth more than the external teeth of flex spline. It is usually used as a deceleration of fix end. Wave generator with an elliptical geometric feature. After wave generator is being assembled on the flex spline, it will be pushed up by the outer periphery of the wave generator and become elliptical. The long axis direction of the ellipse shape is the gear joint of circular spline and flex spline. When the wave generator is driven by the power and starts to rotate, the gear joint portion of the flex spline and the circular spline begin to engage. Each time the wave generator rotates half clockwise, the flex spline rotates counterclockwise by one tooth difference relative to the circular spline. Each time the wave generator rotates clockwise relative to the original position of the circular spline, the flex spline will have a position difference of two teeth in the counterclockwise direction and achieve the deceleration effect. It is an essential component for the development of intelligent manufacturing.